Music is happening. People are making money, making music. Well, I don't know about making money, but people are making music here. And uh, it's happening. You know, East Nashville is happening. Barry Hill is happening. Dave Cobb's house is happening right now. Right. Uh, among other people. Yeah. So, so I, I love it. I'm so happy Robbie, to be here. Robbie, give us your perspective. You you actually went to school here. You graduated from, Be went to Belmont, and then chose to stay down here and make a living, correct? Absolutely. Uh, most of my time... Uh, for, for years was spent in the Christian contemporary pop rock world and uh, the main thing that I saw was in, uh, in 2008, 2009 when the economy tanked, then everything that was already changing changed radically. And uh, so all of a sudden the diversity of music here became important because genres, the, the lines had blurred. There, it wasn't so segmented. So now all of a sudden it's, I'm doing this style this day, this style this day, this day. It, it's, it's all over the map. And I, from a creative standpoint, that's amazing. That's amazing to keep you fresh, yeah. keep you excited, keep you on your toes, and think about, okay, how does what I did yesterday on a rock thing work? You know, how can I apply something to, to a, a rap record that I'm doing today? And, and kind of finding new ways to be creative within that. So Dave, you are on a roll. Um, is part of the inspiration, do you draw inspiration from the city? Is it? I moved here to the best community in the world. There you go. And literally, I, I lived in LA for 11 years. Yeah. And started, kind of started my career there, and it's a great city. I love LA, but this is where art meets commerce. Yeah, man, you know? yes. well put. Well put. So, for all you guys who are asking and aspiring to do things, the location in that you choose to do it from counts. I think when Dave and I were coming up, it was LA or New York or bust. Not that way at all. Dave and I, frankly, struggle with not shooting the show down here six months out of the year because we love this city so much and it's only the studio facility to be able to shoot the show. So, if you're thinking about Nashville as a place to launch from, this is an incredible city, unlike the other bigger cities, you'll be able to talk to people today that will share with you, and you'll be able to have contact with, and so on and so forth. It's a great thing. John, you've seen the scene forever. What, 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 what's your take? Well, this is the center of the universe for live recorded music. Yeah. I mean, this is pretty much the only place you can have sessions with more than one musician at a time. Yeah, Careful that's that's though. true. And, and it, you know, right why would you not want to be here? And the level of expertise of the players is off the chain, isn't it? Yeah. Well, it, yeah, you got to be good or you you're gone. Right. You go home. It's, so it's that cut and dry. If you don't if you don't come in and know your stuff, be able to read, make the changes, follow the direction. You, you got to do it all. Yeah. 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 In uh, in some cities, you can social media your way to the top. Not in Nashville. Yeah. It's just talent alone here. No, that's right. That's right. You got to be able to play. So Ryan, you know the contrast. You've Ryan. done a lot of Straight stuff. You come us. down here and have a good time. What's your take? You're you're an LA boy like us. <laughs> I'm the party crasher. <laughs> my hotel. Room, I just said, can I come hang out? My hotel room. View, I can view one of the classic more popular bars here in town and the I see in I see this guy and this guy walking in and out every damn day. It's well, part of the it's part of what makes Nashville Nashville. What's well, a culture of drinking? In other words it's, it's intertwined with the music here for sure. The community um, rewards alcoholics. But I've I've lived in I lived in New York for six years. I started my career there. Um, I've been in LA for fourteen years and I've been coming to Nashville to work with uh, different artists do sessions down here for the last five, six years. And it is different. I mean, you know, as John was saying, it's the number one place for live recorded music. It's not to say you can't do that in L.A., John. Oh, I've done it. <laughs> or New York. Um, but down here, you can just throw a stone and find a phenomenal musician and say, come over here and uh, I need your talents for this session. Um, the studios are phenomenal. They're not going away here, other than the one we all know about. Um, but you can book a studio on a moment's notice and it's going to be great. You're going to have an assistant engineer that's fantastic. Um, you can go to a bar and run into anybody uh, in the business. You run into rock stars and country stars. I ran into John C. Riley was hanging out at a restaurant the other night. I ran into Dave Cobb and Vance Powell and you just text people and things actually happen here. Um, Don't forget F. Reed. And it, well, yeah, he's over there somewhere. Um, <laughs> as opposed to something like LA now where you can't get people to come out no here it's there's more of a community um, and again not to back on my town and it's an LA, easier drive. but 
there's it's it's an easy drive. It's an easy way to hang out here, and there's just so much getting Barbecue's done. Barbecue is better here too. Barbecue is great. 